Hi guys, welcome to the video. This is my solo run of this week's Ascendant Challenge, which is the Forfeit Shrine. It's week 7, or week 8, sorry, or week 2, whichever way you want to look at it, because we're obviously we're in the second rotation. So, the actual Ascendant Challenge, as I'm showing you here, it's in the Gardens of Hasila. Very, very simple challenge. We're running on Hunter, we're running on uh, Blade Barrage. Uh, I've got Storm Peas on for the additional jump and sprint speed. I've got Midnight Cool on for that additional mobility as well. So as soon as we drop in, as soon as we drop in, I'm going to identify the first orb I'm going to go for and just go for it straight away. So I'm going to take this one to the left, the bottom one. And when you're going for the orb, it's, it's you know very simple. Avoid the blades as much as you can. Take a very straight route. Uh, if you see ads, keep your forward momentum going. Jump over the ads. Don't, don't, don't try and deal with any any ads during this run. And then when you come back, when you actually come back to the center, you're going to be greeted with taking cabal. Now they can actually, if they team hit you, that they, they, they can kill you. So my suggestion is come out the sky, get as high as you can. Use as you can see me here using the orbs melee, which pulls you forward. It's like a thrust. Jump up in the air so that you make it over the Taken Cabal and use the melee so that you melee onto where you're supposed to slam. Because the slam will kill anything that's close to it. And you won't have to deal with any ads. So when I was going to the first orb, as soon as we dropped in I was going to the first orb. Once I picked the orb I tried to identify the next orb I was going to go for as I was going for the first one. Because obviously this was actually my first run of it. You know, it's the first attempt I made. I didn't do this time trial last time because I didn't even know there were time trials. I'd done the first one by complete accident. I'd just done it really quickly. <laughs> didn't realise I'd actually completed a triumph until afterwards. Didn't even identify that, that, that it was a triumph, that there was one for each. Because we were, you know, forsaken it just dropped. We didn't really, we didn't really know, you know, much about the triumphs. So I didn't have this one. So after this, I've got one more to do and that's me done all the time trials so i tried to identify the second orb i was going to go for now we've got the last orb and what we're going to do when we slammed the last orb what i actually done was i was going to take all the knights down quite low with the whisper and finish them with super and then once i actually done it i put two shots on one knight and he had like a third of his health left so i made up my mind and it probably is something you guys could do I just decided to finish them with a super, um, because now we're all pretty high light. This isn't, this isn't really too too difficult. So we're gonna I jump up this tree, and you'll see I, I I put two shots on one one of the knights, and he's like afterwards he's like knackered. He's you know there he is. Look at how much damage one shot does to him. I mean, you'd be, I'm quite surprised that never killed him. Maybe it did. So, the other thing we're going to do, and basically we're just going to run through the centre now. We've got a super, we're, you know, there's a knight coming for us, so we're just going to turn Blade Barrage, and that's one gone. Collect one next super from the Will of, Will of Radiance. And I took out some ads there, that Cabal as well. I was a little bit worried that he would he would end up tagging me. If you If you're interested to know... And most people probably know us. If 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 you're interested to know whether you've killed one of the knights, and you can see it, it will happen. It's the white orbs still disappear from the center. It'll let you know how many orbs there are. So that's the time trail. That's that's how I done it. Now to get the 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 arm car. So this is the chest. There's the portal. I'm just going to shoot across the map to show you the location of the platform we need to be on so we're going to take this route to the left once we get onto it we turn around look down and there's a you, you i'll actually scope in with my sniper to show you exactly where it is so this is my first time on xbox uh i've been building my playstation account so i came on today got this done i've also done the insight terminus solo nightfall which was a lot of fun it was a lot easier than i thought it was going to be so that will be up just after this one so Please give it a look if, you, if you're interested. If you've enjoyed this run, uh, a like rating would be awesome. You know, it really helps the helps the video. Uh, and don't forget to check out, for, especially for when it comes back around, my solo guide and how to complete the Shattered Throne. 
Thanks a lot for watching, guys. I appreciate you as always. You guys are amazing. Take it easy, and I'll see you in the next video.